Check it out, guys. This bunny, our little friend, is back. Oh, it's so humid, it's fouling up the cam, the lens. Let's see if we can get a shot of him. All the humidity is going to foul our foul things up for us. Yeah, I don't see them anymore. Yes, I do. I don't know how well you can see them. I'm trying to clear the lens off so you can see them. Okay. The sun's directly in my eyes, guys, so I hope you can see him better than I can. There he is. Right in our side yard. He's a little guy. Maybe I can get a little closer. I'll go up to my car. I think this is as close as I can get. Wow. Where is he now? I lost him. More epic nature shots, check this out. See if there's any more on these flowers. Yes, one right there. And one right there. And Holy cannoli, look at this. There are bees all over these flowers. Man, it's incredible. Remember last year when I got the bees and the butterflies? That was so epic. I thought so anyway. Well, these two people, they're walking together and they're both, one's on the phone and one's texting. What the heck is that about? 
I see more people do that more and more these days. Craziness. I'm getting some cool nature shots today, guys. These two birds are like in my neighbor's yard. I could have sworn I saw the bunny. Maybe not. There's some cool birds doing their thing. Boy, that grass and stuff overgrown, isn't it? Oh my goodness. What is that? Wow. Tree stuff. Boy, it is so humid today. The heat and humidity kicking my butt. Are you guys like bored of tears of my nature shots? Let me know. I miss the mic. There he is. Maybe that's his partner. How close can I get to these flowers? Dun, 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 dun. And hopefully I won't tick off the bees. I know James says, oh, they won't go after you. Uh, if I get stung, I'm going to be yelling at James. Maybe I should yell at myself. How, how, how stupid were you to take that chance, idiot? <laughs> That's wild, man. So tonight I ordered a, I had some pizza delivered and I'm having a little nice night of beer, pizza, and as you can tell in the background, music.
So tonight, a beer, pizza, and music. <laughs> Hello everybody, it's Trish. How are you? Um, been a couple hot days, but hey, it's summer, right? I mean, I hear people complaining about the heat and stuff, but remember six months ago when we were uh, looking forward to when summer comes? Well, it's here. Okay, so um, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to uh, Jeff Kempen for sending me uh, some very cool CDs. First up, is Paul McCartney. I have this one, but, uh, you know, I have all of these, but uh, I figure, you know, if I need to, sw well, I need to switch out my uh, DJ case, these will be perfect for that. Also, some U2. Which one is this? Akon Baby. Very cool. Um... Yeah, this is, uh, ooh, this looks pretty new, too. Okay. And last but not least, Van Morrison. Yeah. Um, and also, so, Jeff, thank you so very much. And, uh, I, uh, I'm sure at, you know... At some point, I will be adding this to my uh, DJ case. Um, ooh, that one needs a little uh, TLC, but... Um, you know, usually I switch out my... Hold on, I got it. I switch out my uh, DJ case... Uh, around Christmas time, I switch out a section, and I don't always put back the same CDs. And sometimes I switch it up, usually after Christmas, New Year's, and um, so those will be perfect for that. One or two, oh, one or two of them need some TLC, but they're nice. So Jeff, thank you very much. Um. Also, some of you know that I've been searching for Paul McCartney's, uh, uh, Paul McCartney and Wings Back to the Egg. Well, I finally found it. Of course, it's a two C. I don't know how they put uh, two albums on one CD, but it's possible. Um, of course I have Tug of War, but this is what I was looking for. It's a two on one, two albums on one CD, uh, thing, uh, disc. So, um, there it is. Paul McCartney has a tug of war on it and back to the egg. I'm looking forward to spinning this. Um, so yeah, um... Jeff, thank you so much, and uh, there was something else I wanted to tell you. Oh, yes, um, I'm going to be on the lookout tonight for fireworks, because last year, um, with this fireworks falling on a uh, 4th of July, falling on a Wednesday, I'm guessing there'll be fireworks tonight and tomorrow because, like, the 5th of July is Thursday, so I'm guessing a lot of people will be doing fireworks tonight and tomorrow, and uh, the uh, real fireworks will be on 4th of July, but a lot of people around here do the homemade fireworks, and, uh, yeah... All right, guys, so, um, um, oh, and Thursday and Friday I have off, so I don't know what I'm going to do, but whatever I do, I'll bring with me, you with me. So, um, tomorrow and Wednesday, I'll, you know, 
I'll uh, take off from making videos and uh, I'll upload another video Thursday. Oh, and oh, news, 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 news. Player Bowls is open. I haven't checked it out yet, but I just learned that Player Bowls opened, I think it was Saturday. Saturday or Friday. So, uh, yeah. All right, guys. So, I'll talk to you later. And um, that's probably one of the one things I'll do Thursday and Friday is go to Player Bowls and so show you the new setup. Um... All right, talk to you then. Oh yeah, and I shouldn't say I won't be uploading tomorrow and Wednesday if there's something cool going on. If I get that little voice in my head telling me to bring my camera to work and just, you know, uh, pack it, um, wrap it in a plastic bag to keep it from the elements just that might happen i can't so until next time um this could be a uneventful week or a very eventful week so uh i won't promise i'm, I'm gonna take a long break a break till thursday on uploading videos because it's fourth of july week so Anything can happen. So, until my next upload, this is Trish saying peace, love, and keep the good tune spinning. If you guys haven't checked out Jeff Kempin's channel, please do so. He, uh, he has a great collection, and he's a nice man. All right, talk to you later. Bye.